Greetings and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Space Tyrant. Still in early access, yeah, because I recorded these back to back to back. Right, so which mission to do next? And I kind of want to do this one. What's the goal here? Capture holding specific planets. That's kind of a tricky mission. That reminds me of the Omega missions. Alright. It's only the battleship we'll get from this. What about this one? The Jewel Crown. 10 research when I capture a planet. Hmm. Maybe I want to go for an easier. You know, getting the Tyrant score is probably a good idea. Yeah, let's go for this one first. Let's see. I uh, have a new crown. I'll use the translating lens. Just in case I come across a derelict world. Don't know if, it, uh, if that is going to happen. We've also not seen any space beasts yet, but, you know, it may come, since this is a slightly higher difficulty. I can only imagine what a five-star mission would be. Alright, 18 planets or a mass 1400 credits. Sounds easy enough. Alright. Well, Titan Grip, for sure. And you could do with destroyers, but I don't have them, so... Extra firepower it is. Ooh, a genius lab. You know what? Ah, gone. Can't go there. Mm. Poor fortified. Uh, you know what? I'll loop around. Getting this gold mine might be a good idea. Ah. Let's just think about this. In getting Shoktopus would be quite a coup. There's lots more plants off this side. Yeah, I'll do that. Go for Shoktopus first. Just in case there is a... Oh. But at least the Senate is not right next to me. Arena Deathmatch. Well, I can't used any of the other cards yet, so... Yeah, I'll increase my tyranny. Right, we have Shoctopus. Petty King, eh? Uh, sit down and talk. The King agrees to uh, live. To a live <laughs> wide broadcast regaling your generosity and grand plans for reshaping the galaxy. So I'm now extra diplomatic. I think. Yep. Diplomatic 2. Alright. Let's give you another frigate. And this is a primordial world. Hmm. No, I'm gonna send I can I'm gonna send you this way. Alright, let's see. I'll get the reinforcements. Alright, come on, start shooting. If you're wondering what, uh, why I'm not clicking constantly on the ships, is I'm kind of waiting for to see which ship they are shooting at, so I can give them a little bit extra firepower per, per, when they are shooting. Sort of a double whammy effect. Sentient probe. 
Scouts in the system have located a damaged probe of unknown origin. Scans show a device contains an advanced AI system. Advanced sentient AI system. What will you do with it? Well, forces of research, of course. I oh, forgot. I never get any good events when I, that happens. All right. And I already moved you, so nobody to really to shoot at. So I'll save my tyranny. Hmm. They're definitely getting a little bit more aggressive. Um, and let's reduce the fleet HP and show them what I can do. Right. Let's eviscerate this one. It's a damn invasive program, right? Ah, but we win! Chance of me throwing a six would was quite small. Alright, well, in this case, I have something to shoot at, so. And that's. I still have you to move. Let's go this way. I'll stun you. At least the meteors are on my side this time around. Demigod. While exploring some alien ruins, a common soldier touches an artifact which grants him godlike powers. Well, these other three can go disastrously wrong, but this one I have not tried before. Let's bargain with them. You think you've come to an understanding, but you've clearly missed something as your fleet is suddenly thrown into space. Hey! <laughs> Doppelganger! Hey! Um, I'll challenge him to a duel. And I lose some little, little bit less unrest. Cool. Alright, let's bring you up to a level that I'm slightly more comfortable. There. Well, it's all right. I don't need to be that way. Ah, Don. Yeah, yeah. In invade. Ooh, a serial killer. The authorities of the world apparent a serial killer responsible for a string of bizarre and ingenious murders. Due to the unusual nature of the deaths, they bring the case before you for judgment. Hmm. Well. 
Well, let the researchers dissect him. The researchers had to work, but they have nothing of interest. At least the authorities are pleased with the killer's gruesome end. Another point in scientist. Cool. Uh, let's get fast missile racks. Because my cruisers really need extra firepower. Alright. You head over that way. <laughs> cool. Yeah, well, that was to be expected. Alright, let's hire a new commander. Let's see. Specialized ammo causes micro black holes on impact, which you can chain together and destroy the target. 1% chance of 2 insta kill. That's a very neat. Certainly sounding better than a kamikaze. Mm. Yeah, let's get the graphitic ammo. Alright, let's kill this planet. So it doesn't spawn any more militia near me. Gone. Well, nothing else to do. Um... Alright, let's slow you down a bit. Stop that. Alright, you... Crush these rebels. Um, regeneration field, definitely. Can't have any worlds at my back that will ruin my progress. Hmm. Alright, let's see if we can beat this. Uh, don't have any heavy ships. Let's clear the sky. one and now the other one uh, respite let's make you invulnerable for a bit for keeping these uh, on the control. Uh, sure, hack the planets. Get two temporary... Yeah, let's do a shatter. Uh, 
don't have a planet I currently need to bomb. Alright. <laughs> this world doesn't have a power. Let's give it a power. Nope, nothing. Alright. of a defense, but, you know. Yeah, well, no. That's not how this is going to end. Discover nothing. You are useless. Rule, cool. All right. Ah, oh. darn it. Let's see. Can't shatter it again. Alright. Let's see if we can bend this. Hitting the thing a little bit too late. Yeah. All right. That was to be expected, but oh well. Not many real worlds around here that give me money, though. Could do with a couple of good trade worlds. Add a cruiser to the fleet. Uh, no, I can do that myself. Just more firepower for now. Darn, oh, forgot to check the tech again. There should really be a warning for that. Shields are gone. All right, some more asteroids for me. Hmm. Oh, let's study them some more. The guy into some showy, but only for limited scientific value. All right. 
extra rock will do. Since we are a bit reliant on the cruisers being our uh, means of deflecting stuff. Ooh, idle robots. Uh, normally I would smash them up for parts. That usually gives you some money. This would increase the uh, defense of the system if the robots do not rebel. But let's see what the Scientist 2 option is. Hey, Cruise Attack 4. Protection field. Cool. Right, let's... Let's get a little bit extra tech going. Go full ham. On to the money worlds. No, this is my lawn. Little ships can't defend themselves against the firepower from my fighter craft. Although saying fighter craft, they kind of look like space marines. Alright, more money for me. Blast crater. Surrounded by the blast and ruined buildings that make up this world, you find a particularly deep crater. Its heart appears to be an alien device half buried into the ground. Um, carefully plan an excavation. Ooh. Device that turns out to be an amazing weapon. Annihilation field, destroy an enemy fleet. Definitely good, if I can get the, the stones for it. Hmm, which I currently cannot. <laughs> yeah, fortifying is fine. About time you got back. Alright. Hmm. Getting the asteroids over here would unlock my power. Then again, now research is not important. I am here for the money. So, stun you. Now, I'm not entirely sure what the boarding party does. I mean, it says that Space Marines invade an enemy fleet. That's final, but what does that actually do? Does that slow the enemy ship down? Does it destroy it from within? I mean, that's what my, that would be my guess, but I don't know. Oh, an ion storm sweeps through a system and the fleet cannot avoid it. Heavy interference has already blinded all ship's sensors. Well... Since we do have the psionic power, sense your way through it. Yay. Ooh, our ships don't get damaged. Alright, let's activate asteroid mining so we get extra money coming in. Uh, let's see. You can move. This, uh, what's this? Just a lab. 
It's fortified asteroids. But you currently are not hostile to me, so... Hmm... Let's go for the asteroids. Ooh. Darn. And here we have a space slug. Darn. I mean, it's sitting on top of a gold mine, too. I can't, I can't shoot the space slug, by the way. Won't allow me. Ooh. Apparently I can investigate it. It's got a lot, a lot of health. Thick blood, so it can regenerate. And it pretty much one-shots all my little ships. Yeah, I'm not gonna touch that. Right. More ships. They are really spawning the big ships. And of course there's rebels. Mm. Alright, first off, you go here. And the new tech uh, increased folly size. Go with auto fire. Right. Let's speed this up. Let's get this planet. Because that will make things a lot easier. Keep hitting it. Ooh. Well, at least we got it in one go. Sweet. Petty King, alright. Uh up Doctor Hostage. Extra money. Yeah, that's what I want. Alright. Yeah. Asteroid fields forever are unable to track all the debris in the system. You receive no warning as the asteroid begins slamming your fleet. Each moment brings you more dangerous. The size and speed of the impacts increases. Endure it. We lose one ship. Alright, where are the rebels? We have none of that. Alright, and you... Bastards. Oh, come on. We're doing so well. But there's no way that I can uh, do anything here. Oh, we killed it. Cool! 
That usually doesn't happen that way. Then again, I do have those uh, projectiles that can kill something instantly. I forgot I had that. Let's go for the fighter warheads. Uh, add a cruiser back into the fleet. Alright. You head back. Mm. Let's get an invasive program on you. He's down. Yay! Maximum level. I mean, I have a dreadnought. Hmm. That is a pity. the squad go all right now we have all the planets behind us under our control hack the planets we can get extra mana again do I want extra mana? Well, maybe. I mean, I could have gone for the gold mine, but that's kind of out of my way. I need to deal with these rebels, otherwise they are going to just cause problems. So for now, I'll just shoot at you. at the goal too. An orbital strike. Alright, let's go for the rebels. Crush it. I'm not entirely sure what causes rebels to spawn. I mean, I thought it had something to do with maybe the level of unrest to tyranny, but it doesn't seem to be the case because my tyranny has been quite high, at least above 50, so... Hmm... Don't want to increase that production. Uh, darn. Um, right. Could you. You go here. And now I need to throw away a card. Uh, I don't need the orbital strike. Yeah, sure. That's gonna be annoying. Yay, but we have the gold, so we are. <laughs> We've got what we want. Still earned no titles. Probably not playing hard enough yet, then. Oh well. And the Senate forces advance. Alright. Hmm. I'll do more flat damage for all ships. Could be good. Then again, having commanders start with one XP means they get their uh, guess get means they get bigger fleet sizes. Well, at present that doesn't really help me because 
I don't really have the big ships yet, so I'll take the ship damage. And as for where we go next, well, I have to wait and see. But that's for next time. Thank you all for watching.